Hey guys, what's up? And I want to do a video. I'm going to be giving you my thoughts about the S4 and basically Android in general. And since I've been on the been on the iPhone for the past couple of years, and you know, been on iOS for a long time, I want to give you my you know thoughts from an iPhone user. So uh, this is going to be pertaining more to the Galaxy S4 specifics but I will go into just general Android by the way so anyway um, I want to go around the phone first of all because um, it's not time for a review yet I can't make a review yet since I've only had it for two days but I do want to go take a tour around the phone because yeah so um, on the front of the phone here obviously 80% uh, of the front of the phone is screen so we have the 5 inch uh, full 1080p uh, 441 ppi Super AMOLED Full HD display. Um, yeah, the display just looks beautiful on this phone. I mean, that is just an amazing looking display. I mean, if you get up here, let me unlock it. Actually, if you get up close and personal with this this screen, if my camera will focus, I mean, you cannot notice anything. It's really, really amazing. I mean. It's better than the iPhone screen. It's got more pixels per inch. It's like, you know, 1920 by 1080 on a 5 inch screen. Like, holy crap. My monitor isn't even that high resolution. So, I absolutely love the screen on this phone. Uh, bottom, of course, you have your home buttons. And then, if you, yeah, you have your menu key here and your back button there. Or, no, oh, these are touch buttons, obviously, but, yeah. On the top, we have the Samsung logo, the earpiece, if my damn phone camera will focus. Uh, we have the front facing 2 megapixel camera right there. Uh, your assorted sensors here for uh, you know proximity sense like you have a proximity sensor. Uh, I think there's an infrared sensor up here for uh, the uh, smart stay and things like that. I think, don't quote me on that. I haven't uh, looked into all the sensors that are on this phone. Uh, and then there's also a ambient light sensor obviously. I think that's that one. Uh, and then there's a hidden LED uh, over here in this area uh, that lights up when you have a notification or your battery's charging or, you know, whatever. It's a RGB LED, so, yeah, that's pretty cool. On the top of the phone, we have the 3.5-inch um, headphone jack, our secondary microphone, and our infrared blaster. I uh, love the metal band around this phone. Um, it just makes it look really nice, and it's pretty reflective too. So it just looks nice. Here we have the two volume keys. Uh, that's it for this whole side. On the bottom of the phone, we just have the uh, you know micro USB port for charging and connecting to your computer, and the primary microphone. And my camera's having a hard time focusing. Uh, on this side, all we have is the uh, lock unlock. Yeah, so there you go. On uh, the back, we have our 13 megapixel camera, the flash, and the AT&T um, logo right there. And then down here, we have the Galaxy S4 branding and the speaker right there. And as you can see, we have like a, a diamond pattern along the entire rear of this phone. So that is very cool. Uh, and I love I can take the back off and put like you know an SD card or replace the battery or whatever. So when the battery starts becoming crap on this phone, I can just replace it with a new battery. And I also did put a four gig SD card in here for just that much more storage. So um, there's the phone. Let's go ahead and go take a look at the software now. So it's running Android 4.2.2 Jelly Bean, uh, and I absolutely just love it. I have a live wallpaper, which is very cool. And uh, this thing is just so responsive, thanks to that quad-core Snapdra uh, Snapdragon 600 system on a chip. Um, yeah, and the two gigs of RAM, it's just amazing. So, I mean, it's, it's fast. It's very fast. So, I mean, like, my computer, let's see, my compute, my... Computer as of one to two years ago didn't even, didn't even have as much power as this phone does, so that's just freaking awesome. Um, furthermore, I freaking love Android. Like, screw iOS, this is awesome. I can customize pretty much anything I want. I mean, the Play Store is just, you know, 
they're the it's limitless the what you can do with this phone I mean you can there's tons of apps I mean there's tons of different things you can do with this phone and I, I, I can't even go through them all it's just you know that cool so let me go ahead and open up my um, messages here and if I go to this and if I here let's see hold on air view doesn't always work I don't know why but if I go ahead and yeah see I'm hovering my finger over the screen right now I'm not touching the screen I'm not making any contact with the screen and it gives me a preview of my messages so that is just freaking cool um, 4G LTE speeds are amazing you know I was coming from a 3G iPhone so I mean this is just awesome um, you know just all the all the things you can do with this phone I mean you got a bunch of quick settings here and I know this is more part of TouchWiz but still this is just awesome uh, the camera on this phone is absolutely astounding I mean 13 megapixel camera in a cell phone like that is just that's awesome I mean dual camera mode so you can like you know record me too so there's my camera there in the little shot there's me um, and then you can turn that off as well uh, so that feature is actually really good for for um, you know uh, blogging actually that is just that's cool um, you know I mean the pictures on here are just absolutely amazing there's a picture of a hard drive I took yes yesterday I think sticking around with an old hard drive but um, yeah I know it's not an accurate representation to be showing you through a camera but the camera just trust me on this phone is absolutely astounding I love it um, yeah there's not really much more I can say on it this phone is just absolutely amazing and I, I it would take forever to go through all the features on this phone um, when I read, when the actual review of this phone comes out I'm not going to uh, it's not going to be great in other words because there are just tons of other you know youtubers who you know will do a much better job than I can uh, reviewing a you know a phone but yeah so that's my first impressions on the Samsung Galaxy S4 so I'd like to thank you guys for watching